Hello there, I'm Madra Hill. Welcome back to CK2 Succession Games, starring King Viking of Kent of House YouTube, which should be Aldra Hill, but Mordred sucks and was not able to provide me that. Ah, hello. You appear to be having a whoopsie doodle with a little revolt. Well, that's a shame. That's a very big shame, isn't it? Unfortunately, I still can't really make my way over there because I don't have enough piety to just flat out invade it. Oh god, they called the King of Asturias. That's okay, no one cares about stories. So let's just take a check. 250 piety and 112 gold. Or 200 piety and 338 gold. So probably that one. But unfortunately if I do that, the Pope doesn't like me. And also everybody doesn't like me. Jesus. That's terrible. That is awful. Oh no, my niece is an imbecile. She should be a, a warrior. Urgh, I reach to fight. One thing would be good if I could try and get, like, um... Let's actually do this. Let's take a look. Search all. And join court, yes. Do, 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 do. And let's do it by diplomacy rankings. So we do have a couple people who would be willing to join me. But unfortunately, they need to be male. So let's just... Go gender. Cool. So we have a 19 dude here. And a 21 dude here. But he's way too old. Let's invite the 19 dude. Invitation to court. There you go, buddy. Because Morvike is not doing good enough here. Alright, he needs... He needs something a bit different. Obviously, people are going to be a little bit upset, but that's alright. We don't really care. So now it's up to 18% chance to get those sweet, sweet claims. Alright. One other thing to do, actually, might have been to get, a, to get invite claimants. So that might be a good idea. Let's take a look at some of these claimants we have available. So, are there any claimants we could invite who have strong claims to these provinces? Oh my, there are literally no one. And which we can then um, give them a province. That is a strong claim on the province of Lindsay. Oh boy, welcome to the jungle. Which means we can start to grab, grab two provinces for the price of one. By uh, conquering one province, we can then award it to him and then press his claim on Lindsay, conquering another province, which would allow us to get access to York. Uh, you need a focus. You can have Diplo. Pick that somewhat arbitrarily. Oh, for God's sake, people are trying to kill my son now. Get it together, guys. Come on. Um, Alright, this isn't so great. I think it might be a good idea if I start trying to bang my way to the top. We just basically need to wait, don't we? It's a shame. A crying shame, guys. Ooh, hello. You can have thrift. Hey now, don't be like that. Oh, rebellions everywhere. Oh, my wife died. No. I will call my dog my dog faithful. I got that dog. That's good. So I need a new wife. Oh, hello. The Duke of the Isle of Man. I don't... I somehow feel that's maybe not the best alliance for me. It's not even the right kingdom. So, maybe not. <sighs> Wait, Durham? Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. Now we're cooking. Now we are cooking. The kingdom... Countess of Devon? <sighs> it's too old, though. You are too old. King of Cornwall. There's loads of female counts here. What's going on? Got children everywhere though. Someone useful. I think I think just trying to get the, the chiefess of Anhalt Anhal, sorry. Of Durham. I think that's a good idea. And then it'd be uh, my dynasty. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let's do it. Boop, and boop. There you are. It's just one county, but county's a county, you know. It's going to take a little while before we're actually able to grab this province, but we do have a lot of piety. This is the thing. So maybe we should just expend it to invade on one of these provinces, which we can then use to get a claim onto Lindsay, which we can then use to press onto that and repeat the whole process over again. Oh, improve the town and make city vassals like me, or... Yeah, I'll improve vassals, thanks. 
What's this? Bet arrange betrothal between my niece and the heir to the Duchy of Almeria. Aha. Uh -huh. That would be nice. Bavaria is over there. Sure. I think it might be a good idea if we just do this, to be honest. Oh, I can't declare war. What do you mean I must have a valid case this belly? Oh, they're a tributary state. Rut row. Okay, too much medicine bees on the something. Okay, yep. Advanced just benefits all. Which means I have to push into these guys instead. Okay, that's fine. Stewardship. Yes. Okay. So let's take a look at the ducal areas here. So we're going to get Lindsay. Uh, I think we should definitely try to get Warwick. So I think we should try to grab Warwick. So a border dispute over Warwick. They would call in the King of Asturias, but no one cares about that. So I would lose quite a bit of money and piety. But to be honest, it doesn't really matter. I could then give that... I could take it for myself and then give a different county to the Count of Lindsay and then use that to nick the ducal title of Leicester and use that to continuously push on conquests. Awesome. Let's do that. Uh, I've got a lot of troops, so... Actually, while they reinforce, let's just... Um, where's the place that has the highest levies? Uh, Race personal levies. I really wish I could actually just see which places have the highest numbers of troops. So, 209... 600... Ow, why you do this? Wait, do I have a Baron title? I do, I have a Baron title. Why do I have a Baron title? Goodness sakes. Oh, I'll get rid of that later. All right, so it'll be in Kent. So let's just train troops in Kent. But just like three months to try and increase the levies available. Oh, a friendly courtier paid his respects to me. Okay, it's a bit, it's a bit weird. Not going to lie, but all right. Also, it might be best to wait for this. Wait, what? Defending against Earl Edward of Chester in Chestorian War for Egbert's claim on Mercia. Oh, wow. So he's actually pressing his claim on Mercia, which he doesn't. Okay. And he's also defending against the Mercian Revolt in the Civil War to increase council power. Oh, my son. Ambitious. Um, I really don't want to die, so I'm not going to give you ambitious. Sorry, Remy. Sorry. Not going to give you that. But I kind of want to wait for this rebellion to kind of end first and see who gets it. Oh, actually, no, I do. Because I, what I want to do is I need to kind of wait for him to die because there'll be a truce. And I want the truce to end as quickly as possible. So I want to take the problems from him, give it to the person who has Lindsay, and then immediately, like... You know what? I can actually give him the Baron title, couldn't I? Hmm... I could actually immediately give him the Baron title. As soon as, but then again, I have to wait for the Civil War to end. Damn it! Ugh. Ah, strategies. I have a new heir. Hey, everyone's voting for my gay son. Oh dear, he's gay and chaste. Suboptimal. <gasps> my claim on Gloucester's come to fruition! Yes! Alright, release tributary. There we are. Thank you. I'll see you later, buddy. Let's claim Warwick next. Why not? Hello. Yeah, there we are. Gonna beat you up again. Oh, hey. What's this now? What's up, that? Called in a Count of Leon. That's fine. Does he have alliances with... No, he doesn't have alliances with the Picts this time. That's good. Oh, shit. Lost control there. Uh, no, I don't want my daughter to help. So, by the way, the reason that happens is if you have uh, two or more traits that are 12 or more, then you can give them ambitious, which is an amazing stat, but it makes them hate you forever. And I really don't want that. Just kind of obliterate them real quick. Very easy fight. Well, easy enough. Got a Baron. Uh, gonna ransom you. Available. Yes, thank you. Hello. Can I ransom you too? Yeah, okay. Be a dick. Young Aldrahilly is explorer. She wants to become patient. Nice. 
Wipe them out. Chase down their armies. Ah, oh, there we go. So he is a fortune builder. Yes! I have groomed an heir. Brilliant. We'll now have an achievement to become King of England. King of England. Obligate the vassal to not be a dick. Thank you. Oi. Come back here. Come back here. Where do you bloody think you're going? Sneaky sod. Always trying to get away. Right. Just go and take that, because obviously the war goal is that. Oh my god, the county of Warwick. Use it, yes. Oh, I love you. That's fantastic. Okay. Let's claim the county of Somerset next. Children's education focus with my nephew. Uh, you should definitely have Marshall. Brilliant. We're growing very nicely here. My heir does not have a child. But I'm not sure if I really want to marry him so soon. No, I do to make sure the dynasty stays alive. Uh, let's marry him to... No, I don't want anyone, like, anyone with some good traits. Attract... No. Quick. Anyone without gonorrhea, maybe? It'd be nice if I could get like a strong alliance or something. I'll tell you what, what about with the Duchy of Dehubarth? Oh, here we go. What if I murder this sucker? Here we go. I start spamming some gifts around. Murder their husband. Oh my god, she'll even do it. Oh my god, she will join the plot to kill her own husband. Fantastic. That's amazing. And then marry her. Brilliant. Oh god, is he in two wars? Defending against the England Scholar in the Sussex Sussex Wixexian de Jour War of Achilledare. What the hell? Wait, who owns Achilledare? What's happening? Oh, there. Why do you even think to own that? What's wrong with you? That's a very foolish decision, and you know it. I mean, really. Ah, man. How are people going to grab my stuff? Nice. Look at these claims. Arrange marriage with... Oh, it's the arrangel. Yes, that's fine. And I will take the cash. Thank you. Hey. It's mine, I'll have you know. I'm taking Gloucester for myself. So we have a claim on the Count of Derby. Oh. Got claims bloody everywhere. This is fantastic. Isn't this amazing? Okay. So I've actually got claims on Derby. Um, let's... Yeah, let's get Somerset as well. Spymaster, I need a new Spymaster. You'll do. Anyone else want to join this? No, that's alright. Better yet, actually, where, where, where exactly is he residing? He is in... Oh, he's a Prince of Asturias! Oh my. Very interesting. So he is actually in Dyfed. So let's send our Spymaster... To build a spy network into Dyford. Let's siege this bad boy out. County of Essex has inherited the County of Essex. Good stuff. I'm glad to hear it. An arranged marriage from my niece. Yes, enjoy. Let's keep sieging this down real quick. Another Pope death. Goodness me. Go kill this army before they de siege my stuff. Brilliant, and enforce demands. It's another county for me. Right. Lovely. Okay, so, there's a lot of new claims here. Oh my god, this jerk has an alliance with Middle Frankia. But he is in a lot of wars, so I think it'll be fine. Uh, if we just lightning fast. Okay. 
So, what we need to do now is to ensure that we keep passing on people with good claims. So, no claims there. No claims there. No claims there. That's fine. But what about a claim in Devon? Um, da -da 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 -da. Claim in Devon. No. Okay. Cornwall. No. How are there no claimants to these titles? Has there just been singular succession all the way through? Jesus. How about York? It's quite a minuscule little area. Unfortunately, no males. That's okay. How about Norampton? No. Bedford. This is welcome to the game of CK2, by the way, guys. This is what you've got to do. You've got to click through endlessly, hoping you find someone with strong claims. And that's a weak claim, so that's no good. And that, my friends, is a strong claim to the county of Derby. Unfortunately, he will die very quickly. Uh, which will become a weak claim. On succession, strong claims are only given to children who are second or third in line of succession. Oh no, so it should actually become a, um, a next one. Okay, that's cool. So, he has a strong claim to the county of Derby. Probably could have just looked it up straight from that. This guy has a weak claim in the county of Derby and a strong claim on the county of Lindsay. Okay. Let's grant this guy the county of Lindsay claim. So we're going to give him Gloucester. Brilliant. Which now allows us to press the claim of someone very lovely. In fact, we could press both of them, but unfortunately he's a bit of a dick. And he's got a bit too many men to his hand. Okay. Oh, so we've got a lot of claims as well. Strong claims, etc, etc. Got claims on Somerset as well. We're very we're getting we're getting on there, we're getting on. Ah Hello, Queen of Burgundy. How are you? So we could marry our lovely heir to the Queen of Burgundy, thus giving us a decent ally in these troubled times. Let's do it. We can actually usurp the Duchy of Huess. Giving me a silly number of duchies. And it will also allow me to declare war on him again for my ducal claim of a hoist, which allows me to just take it, but without prestige loss. With a little bit of prestige loss. But I've got to wait 10 years to do that, but that's fine. Um, I have the Duchy of Essex, right? No, I actually don't. Hmm. So I actually can almost make the Duchy of Essex. Yeah, so if I just take one more province of Northampton or Bedford, I can actually take the Duchy of Essex. So, is there anyone here who has any claim? No, there are literally no claimants who are worth it. Come on, bro. How do I... How do I get you here? Must be an adult. Damn. Alright, so we just have to invade and take Warwick, basically. Or we can just go... Like this. There we are. I'm going to wait just a touch because there are some very big wars, including Francian Wars. And then we're going to ride home to victory and take Warwick for ourselves. Like, super quickly. Part of me actually kind of wants to take the claim of Derby or Lindsay. I will take Derby because it's a weak claim. And it's better to take a weak claim now. And he's got a strong claim on Lindsay. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he can... Oh, because it's a child. Yeah, so it's better to take Derby now. And then we can take Lindsay next time. So we're going to take Derby now. Hello. So claim Derby. We're going to raise all these forces. Oh dear. Is this really what you want to do, my friend? I feel like this is going to be very bad for you. Get some more tech as well, so we get military organization, which increases morale of armies and retinue bonuses. Alright, let's, let's just go kill them. 
So, 25th of January, 28th. 28th, cool. Nice, we get to obliterate them very quickly. I really wish I had more archers, though. So we are going to want to finish this fight very quickly. I thought it seems that Earl's friend decided to come out hiding, no longer fearing for his life. Well, that's nice. Oh, did you seriously? Seriously not? Oh, you jerk. You absolute tosser. Oh, no. No, yeah. Okay. You refused to marry the person I said you to. You tosser. Okay. We can actually call him Burgundy if we wanted to, but we're not going to, because then they would actually trounce our war score. So, yeah, not going to do that. Got some disease in Derby, it seems. Quickly wipe these guys out. Oh, burn the apostate, my brother. I don't particularly want to burn the, my this apostate. No, we're not going to burn him. I'm not going to burn my own bloody brother, am I? I mean, really. I need him for succession purposes. Okay. Don't care. I got really confused. I was looking at my wife. I was like, wait, why is she of Kent? But then I realized I'm obviously of Kent. Oh my god, I captured him. That's fantastic. Um, let's just enforce it then. Nice. Force demands. Beautiful. So I could actually found a new kingdom right now. But I'm not going to do that because that'd be silly. In the next episode, we're going to wait for Truth Timers to tick down to be able to invade the next dude again. We kind of just want to keep cycling these things and keep pushing things back as best we can. Make sure to leave a like and comment on the video. Let me know if you the series so far. I was Aldra Hill and I continue to be, and this has been some CK2 Succession game. Thank you very much for the save. Started by Midge and passed from Mordred, and look forward to it, Remy. Bye-bye.